What is up everybody, Finn here from Double Tap Gamers and today we're on something totally different. We are on, on Cubic Castles. Now first of all, I want to quickly talk to you guys about something. Now, if you've been following my Twitter, you will already be aware of this anyways. I actually hurt my back and I've been taking some medication. Now as of today, I took a side effect to the medication and became quite unwell. So, in relation to Let's Plays and things like that, things are going to be sc like staggered a bit and I do apologize for that. But I will try to get some contents and first impressions of some crazy games and stuff which are out there on the channel to kind of keep you guys still there. Okay, so what we're going to take a look at today is Cubic Castles. Now this game is in beta version 0.8.4. I caught a glimpse of it when I was scouring the internet, we will say, and basically the game is a bit like Animal Crossing meets Minecraft with an MMO aspect to it so you can play with your friends, you can build things together. At the moment it's free, the link to the website will be in the description, but as you can see in the top left it is www.cubiccastles.com and you can download it for, I believe it is Mac and I'm using it on Windows and I say it's got this whole MMO kind of aspect to it and you can explore and things like that. So we're going to basically, we're going to name a character because we haven't actually played it yet. So we're kind of going in the blind on this one, so we're going to just put Double Tap Gamer. We'll put Double Tap Gamer there and we're going to hit play. And it's going to fetch realm. So now we're going to do a tutorial. So as you can see, the graphics are really nice. It's kind of like over the top Minecraft. It's it's pretty yeah, uh, it's pretty good actually, guys. It's pretty good. It seems all right. So let's have a look at this. I do like it. Like I say, this is alpha as well, and it it looks quite good for alpha. So welcome to cubic castles. Follow the path. Okay. So we've got to follow the path, anyways. So well, like I say, I don't know how long this episode's going to be, give or take, considering my health at the moment. But see the black tried tapping on it, okay. Pop. And we get a brick. What's this brick of? Let's have a look. It's a stone brick. So, yep, I did pick up the little stone. And I did notice it's in my inventory. Okay, so. Try selecting the stone. So that's pretty cool. It shows you actually where you're from as well, the United Kingdom. You must do that by IP. So, double click the stone. And it says that I could split the item. But I just want to highlight it. Right, so we have it highlighted. Do we? Yep, so we just left click and it places. That's pretty cool. I, I do like that. That's how you build. Pretty easy. So, let's see. If you want to get back to the pulling, just click on the hand icon. No problem. So, I never actually played Animal Crossing here. It was a pretty good game. But I did play, well, I have played Minecraft, as you noticed by the channel. So, go ahead and grab it all. So, we're getting given free goodies. Pretty cool, eh? Seems pretty good, this game, actually. It runs really smooth as well. Yep, I did get it all. And I do believe you can click on a link so you can forward for this under the Steam client so it can actually appear in Steam, like kind of green light it. Back them. It's pretty good. Whether they're going to keep it free to play when it gets released, I'm not too sure. Right, so we got to drop these materials in here, right? So. Let's put some sandstone, some stone, and some spray paint. And what can we make? Can we scroll down on this? Is there a way of scrolling down? Or do we have to press down? How do how do we go down, I wonder? Hmm. Oh, wait, we just drag it up. Right, so, actually, let's make some red brick. Let's make the max of it. Let's take these back. Alright, so we've got two. We've got two of that. Ah, oh, cool, we've got a hat. Click the character to wear this. Yeah, look at that, that's pretty boss. <laughs> Put a smile on my day. Alright, well, we're already ahead of that one. Look out for the spikes. Okay, let's just walk around them. So the hearts at the top show my health. Can we jump on this? Actually, we can, we can jump. So you could tap on that little bubble up there to talk to other people. So we can actually talk to other people as well, which is cool. And you get a better view by Q and E. Well, that's pretty good. That kind of reminds me of Fez. You know how you can turn things around. That's pretty good. Seems all right so far. So good, guys. Okay, so now we're going into the world. Right. So this is the world map. Right. So. Let's have a look. So, right, so this is your deed. So click on the deed. And click on the green spot to build this. Right, okay, well, I just want to be right here. Taps Gamers, right, so DTG World. There we go. Let's set that. 
So there we go. So we have a world now for DTJ. So, so jump in. There we go. Just simple as that. Now that's pretty good, actually. There seems to be a lot of places nearby as well. Right, so we've got some presents. Presents always good. So this is your starter castle. Starter castles don't have many resources, so visit mines to gather useful materials. Protect your castle using the realm setup in the menu. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Can I just take all the... Oh, I fell down. Can I take this? Yep. Okay then, no problem. So, this is my little world, is it? Seems pretty good. I presume we can mine through all the ground. It's not too bad. Can we? Can we? Yep, we can push that out of the way. That's pretty awesome. Well, we've got some trees here. Let's, um, let's take the trees. Right, let's take a look at the items which we've got then. So this is with Paul. We've got some red plaster. We have a wood table. A ribbon. Stone block. Blue plaster. Pink flower. Old wooden chair. And an anvil. So we need the anvil because we need to be able to build. So where are we going to set up a crafting area? I do not know. But like I said, this this is kind of just give you an idea what it is. The game runs like I say, really smooth. It looks really nice. We can't really... We can't zoom in. So we're always going to be looking over the top, but having a kind of a a Minecraft kind of over the top game really appealed to me. It was kind of like, I'm into this whole city building thing at the moment. And this kind of has has that aspect where you can build, you know, so we've got to protect and stuff, they said. So let's find, so we just, do we just double click these out? How did, I didn't, I didn't want to build that up. Have we got something highlighted by accident? Nope. We've managed to... Okay, do 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 do. Right, okay. We've managed to pull this up. Not too sure. So we're going to have to learn how to make recipes, I believe, on this. Now, let's have a look what this is. So there's the Cupid store. We've got our outfit. We've got friends. We've got realm setup. Realm setup, right. So who can build in this realm? Only me. Actually, me and my friends. Who can visit this realm? Anyone. Anyone can visit. So who can access setup? Only... Only me. So you can actually put people on trust to people. You can ban people from coming in. You can have visitors. Well, that's pretty... That's pretty good, actually. Let's take a look at the outfit. Now, the outfit, I presume, will be your armor, which we don't have any at the moment. Now, what is the store? Now, is this going to be kind of... Well, you got to buy things with actual money, I wonder. So now it's thinking about opening the Cubit store. Let's have a look at this. So we could buy cloven. So you buy cloven with with this stuff, this this currency. Cubits. So to get cubits, you do actually have to pay. Well, that's a bit of a shame, but you might be able to earn them as well. Different castle deeds, items. So they've kind of got everything to kind of support the game in, in place as well. You can get these different kind of block packs where it's a, it's a bit like a texture pack in a way. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Don't know if I'll be buying some blocks. We'll see how it goes, you know. Right, let's let's start and let's get busy. Right, so let's just see how things work around here. No, no, no. Come back, come back. That's what it is. Yeah, you don't want to kind of drag and drop. Right, so, we've got to drop materials in, so we have stone. What can we make with stone? Nothing. Is there any that goes with stone? Green plaster, grass, dirt, bush. Nope. Maybe if we take the bush, right? It doesn't give a wood. I thought that would have actually given us some wood. Well, maybe it's not. Maybe it's not. Oh, so that like just automatically jumps you up. So let's get back down. So because I actually had, oh, that's pretty cool. I've added turret. Now we've got to click. Ah, uh, yeah, we've got to click on the hand. Hey, who's this guy? Okay, and some some random guy came into the world. Let's let's tell him welcome to the YouTube channel. Hi, welcome to my YouTube video video. Nice to meet you. So 
So it's just some guy just just jumped in. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty cool. So with the pull tool, I would imagine we could probably pull out here. Yeah. Yes, we can get wood. And he said hello, and he left. <laughs> he might have been a bit intimidated. Right. So now we've got some wood. Maybe so we can make it. Whoa! Ah! So it's it's gonna get. <laughs> I pulled it off. I'm so derby today. Right. So I don't want to put right. That's it. That's it. That's the one. Right, so I want to put some of this in. I want to just take some some stone. No, we we still can't build with that. I wonder. I wonder. I wonder. I wonder if there's a way to get find out crafting materials because that's the store itself, and I I believe you would be able to get kind of. Yeah, I would imagine you would have some sort of tools because if you take the pull, let's bump. Let's take this out. You can actually, you can you can go into the ground. Physically take everything out. Well, I'll have to look into that because it definitely seems something I would like to play. Now I'm going to go back to the world. We're going to see if we can jump into somebody else's world. So let's have a look. Well, that's my world. That's some guy. 5,207 blocks jumped in. Built in. Wait, let's see if we can jump in. And see if we can say hi to someone. Right, well, we're in this person's world. He seems to have a blueprint bench. And he's got some crazy, crazy looking trees. He's got some things all nicely lined up, so. Maybe that's the key. Maybe he's got to kind of like line things up. This place is quite big, actually. Can you, can you run any quicker? No? We can we can't jump around. He's basically just flattened the whole area, hasn't he? Yeah. So that's pretty cool. So there you go, guys. I've seen the game. I will definitely put a link. Oh, double jump. There we go. It's in on this construction. Nice. So now you have. Oh, what are you? Actually, before we before we end this episode, we've got we've got to take a look at this because uh, look at all this over here. I didn't know this existed. Magical girl. Locks built. That's pretty cool. What are you? Ponyville? Learn recipes yet. Ah, oh, that's pretty cool. We can go and learn recipes. Let's have a quick look at that before we end the episode. So we can come here and we can learn different things. So what? what's the sign say here? Please report any errors to Grey Milk and Ponyville. Fun facts section. Blue note icon. So, yeah. So this is going to teach us everything about the basic. Basics, so two dirt, tree troughs, water, mixed soil, stone block, which is free stone, stone brick is four stone, iron, free iron. Wow, there is an absolute load. Look, there's the tools. So you need iron and stuff to make all the different like kind of hammers and stuff like that. Man, there is quite a lot to this game actually. There's quite a lot to learn. So I am better, we will definitely revisit this, and like I say, if you want it, just hit that like button, guys, it means a lot. But until then, thank you for watching this episode, and like I say, go and download it, man, it's free at the moment. If you like it, hit the kind of green, green like button. Support these guys, because this is really nice, things are pretty sorted, this drop system, that's pretty cool. So until then, I will see you next time, and I should be better, but until then, do apologise. Thanks for being on Standing Patient, and stay safe, guys. See you later. Begins again.